Hey everybody, Fifth Horseman here, playing more FTL, and we're playing easy mode today. And by easy mode, I don't mean this button up here. We always play on normal mode. By easy mode, I mean we're playing the Carnelian, <laughs> which is one of the easiest ships. There is somebody, I don't remember who it was, I promised you'd be, or I didn't really promise, I said you'd be on the uh, the next ship after the Nether. N nether. <laughs> I still don't know how to say it, even though somebody told me how to say it, I forgot again. Um... And you're not on this because a couple of people, uh, new people have asked. I put new people at the beginning of the list because I figure that's fair. Everyone else, everyone who's been on the ship already has been on a ship already. And the new people haven't. So uh, you're still on the list. You're just not going to be on the Carnelian. You will probably be on the next ship I, I fly unless more new people ask for their names. Let's get out there, though, and do some playing here. I am the pilot, but I will. Uh, I am destined to uh, be joining you guys in... Let's see. Oh, I guess we can power everything. Uh, I am destined to be joining you guys in the teleporter, uh, but you guys go down first. Uh, I make sure everything's okay on the ship, and then I go in and join you in the second squad. That's the way I like to play this. And another way I like to play it is jumping to a store first, because you, know, you can buy a whole bunch of stuff. Actually, I can sell Crystal Vengeance, even though it doesn't really help that much. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to sell Crystal Vengeance. And I almost want to buy <laughs> this Mantis. But no. Instead, I am going to hold on to this until... Jeez, another sword. I'm going to hold on to this until we, uh, until we see um, what kind of ships we go against. Okay, the first ship we go against is something we can't kill, which is kind of super annoying. Okay, you get in there. You get in there. I could send my guys over to disable stuff. And you know what? That's actually not a bad idea. Let's uh, send him into weapons. We can cloak through the first thing. Oh, and it hit my shields anyway. And now I don't have shields for, <laughs> for when this thing shoots three times at me. <laughs> that is super duper fair. Okay. Just don't missile my teleporter and ruin this run. Okay. Now you guys come back, fix the oxygen, and then we'll get out of here. That was terrible. Ain't nobody got time for this. Okay. Actually, you fix the engines. You fix the air. <laughs> Four hits in the first sector, in the, in the first jump, in arguably the easiest ship in the game. Brilliant! Okay, now you get up to the shields and fix those. Okay, you get up and help him. And I'm actually going to cloak through this missile again, even though it's probably going to hit me again. Wow! Okay, I'm going to actually sit here and try to fix up the shields. I'm only going to jump when he fires his missile again. Because I'm trying to get my guys ready <laughs> to go here. Okay, let's get out of here. <laughs> That's crazy. That's like the worst thing ever. Uh, offer to board their ship. Um, yeah, we could do that. Agree to capture the ship. Yes. Okay, good. It's a quest marker. That means my guys can heal themselves up. And that's a guaranteed fight against people, which is which is the kind of fights we can win. Okay, let's get on there. Let's uh, not go to that store. Two jumps and we haven't gotten... There three jumps and we haven't gotten any scrap except for selling Crystal Vengeance. Okay, let's get into the, me the weapon bay here. Let's lock that thing down as soon as... There we go. And then he's going to fire... Okay, he didn't fire his missile, so now it's my turn to get back there. Uh, they have a med bay, so I'm going to actually let them in. Oh, I'm not going to let him in, because the missile came back up. <laughs> Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to teleport into the med bay, lock it down, and destroy it, and then I'm going to join them in the room here as soon as... <laughs> Yay! 14 scrap. Let's head on home. That's the way these fights are supposed to go. I'll get back up in the cockpit while you guys heal up. 
And we'll be on our merry way. We need to find some slavers. The joy of this ship is when you when you meet a slaver, you get free slaves and all their stuff. Most of the time. Mostly. Okay, let's head up here. Uh, more missiles! I am getting a little annoyed with the missiles, and they're charging up their thing. I don't really want to teleport over. I'm going to run the risk of lots of dying. Because it's bad enough that he is going to get away. Period. <laughs> um, I do not have the engine to get out of here before he does. And I can't kill him, so the last thing I want to do is let him stick around. Um, yeah, there we go. Uh, you go ahead and fix that. We got no reason really to not fix it. Yep, there goes him jumping away. Yeah, fire that extra missile right at the end. Oh, I could have clicked through it. Oh, well. I know, the other yeah, rebels are coming closer. Okay, we're going to fix up, and I... Well, actually, you know what? It's going to be pretty quick, so... I'll keep you on. Actually, while I keep you on, I'm going to tell you, uh, next week, um, I am going on a vacation, and I can tell you that because I'm recording, basically, I know that roughly when this is going to come out. Um, if I can get another... Um, here's my quest. Uh, yeah, I'm going to go to it now. I'm actually going to... Actually, I'm going to up my dodge one. I'm going to eschew shields for the moment. I didn't need to buy that uh, that power. I could have taken it out of the medbay. Oh, well. Um, but yeah, so if I can get another run after this one, and this one lasts a decent number of turns... I can't take this ship intact. It's a freaking Zoltan ship. And he's got a beam weapon. So now I got a cloak. I just have to run away. I can't teleport on board. Why aren't you uh, dodging and why aren't you in the shields? Thank you for missing. Thank you for missing. That was very nice of both of you. Oh, yeah, that didn't miss. <laughs> this is terrible. This is a horrible run. Okay, now that we're cloaked, get us fix the teleporter. We can fix the medbay after next battle. Bye. Ugh. Attack the pirate or ignore them. We are attacking them. Okay, teleport into weapons and I'll lock it down. And I locked down the teleporter room. Oh, well. <laughs> miss. Oh, you didn't miss. And then now, yeah, go ahead and beat the crap out of everything because that's what you do. Magically getting through everything. Actually, let's wait until... Okay, it did hit, so I'm going to cloak. And they're going to be dead, so I'm going to go up and fix the teleporter. <laughs> 14 scrap, and we contact the settlement, and they give us more. That was very nice of you. But I can't teleport my guys back because of this, so now I'm going to pause the game. Okay, we're ready to go. We've got 53 scrap. I am going to... Uh, I'm actually going to buy those shields that I, that I should have bought last time, really. And I'm going to do this with them. Because that would have made that battle completely un... That wouldn't have done any damage to me if I had two shields. And I know that. I don't know what my problem was. Uh, okay, let's go here. Oh no! Cloaking to escape, outrun it, or fight it. Well, let's cloak to escape. Because it's an automated ship, and I can't hurt it. Moving on here. Da 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 da. There's nothing here. I can make it here before the rebels get to the exit, so I'm gonna. Giant alien spiders. Sorry. We do not fight giant alien spiders. We also like to have our stuff powered. And I can actually buy that last power, so I might as well. And let's go to the exit. We're actually ahead of schedule, although our ship is beat to crap. Um, buy some fuel. Yeah, don't really... Not helping. That, that was a crappy first sector. Let's hope that things get better as time goes on. If I go up here, I have to go through at least one nebula. 
If I go down here, I don't have very many reds, but it's better than nothing. I got two reds. Three reds, actually, I can hit. So let's go ahead and go down here. Ah, uh, store is useless. Okay, we're going to go like this, into this nebula, and then down here. I think that works. Probably want to upgrade our piloting. Probably should have done it last time, but not a big deal. Approach the station or keep your distance. Well, we can't hurt him, so let's keep our distance. And by hurt, I mean destroy. <laughs> I could hurt him. It just wouldn't help. Okay, here we go. Let's get into there. Let's make sure I'm still piloting. I am. So, Nigel. There we go. And they're on the ship. Uh, let's do... Let's close off some areas here. Okay, they picked down there. Actually, I can survive a while. Let's, let's wait until we know if they're coming to me. Okay, um... We're destroying their, sh their weapons. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna... I'm gonna wait a second. Okay, he's going to the oxygen room, so let's open that door. He's going to the engine room, let's go open that door. I said open that door. Let's turn off the air. Okay, he's going to shield. Let's open those doors. Now let's open my doors. <laughs> uh, okay. And they're in, but it doesn't really matter because he can't hurt us. So, as soon as they get to this room, I'm going to run up to the teleporter. Now I'm going to open this door and close this one. Oh, I know what it is. I actually, I changed, uh, I installed a mod. Uh, I don't have any lines on the ground for when, when we're out of oxygen. Okay, so I'm going to teleport in here, and you guys are going to come in and join me. And the guys on our ship all died, which is good. Let's go ahead and get air back on it. I actually might exit out and unmodify that because I really like to see those lines. Um, I, I installed my Black Opal mod to, to, to test something because somebody on the forum said that, uh, that it was broken. And I was like, I don't think it is. So I installed it to test and make sure that it, that it was okay, and it is. But, uh, yeah, it doesn't tell me how much oxygen is in the room. You strip it of useful materials. Like, let me turn the air on. I am going to save and quit, and I will be back when I have uh, when I have air. Okay, well that's weird. I'm in a nebula. I was I'm almost positive I was not in a nebula before, uh, <laughs> but exiting the game and uh, taking away that mod and coming back into the game has apparently put me in a nebula. So I guess I'm in the realm of cheating right now. But there's not much I can do about it because that's just what happened. I I honestly have no clue what what to do about that. Um, it's also good that I un that I uninstalled the thing because I just remembered that um, that uh, I, I modified events, which might be why uh, this thing is different now. I don't know, but oops, <laughs> that's what you get sometimes. So let's go ahead and heal our guys up, uh, and I will. Uh, I don't only take a second, but anyway, my vacation. Um, yeah, I'm gonna try to get enough videos recorded that I can upload them still because I'll have internet where I am. But uh, I'm not going to be playing too many video games, so uh, that's just the way, you know, vacations work sometimes. So uh, I'll very likely won't have Kerbal Space Program videos, but uh, I should be able to... Yeah, this is a completely different sector than it was before. <laughs> um, oops. Uh, let's go ahead and update our piloting here. It's funny, I'm, I'm fighting the same ship, just in a nebula now. But, uh, yeah. Automated ship, look at that. Wow. Couldn't have predicted I'd find one of those here. But the good news is, is I he can't hurt me, so we're just gonna wait through this. But yeah, I'm gonna be uh, I'm gonna be leaving town this coming Tuesday, which probably be uh, the day the the episode after this one I think will be posted. Maybe that day, I'm not sure. But um, no, it'll actually it'll probably be after this is over. So I might have to actually record two more things. 
And then, of course, as I as I expect, I, I fully expect uh, Advanced Edition to come out possibly on the very first day of my vacation, because that's the way my luck works. But if it does come out, um, the next video you see uh, after whatever I record for the vacation, uh, this store is crap, will be uh, will be the Kestrel in the new Advanced Edition, which will be awesome. And if it's not, I'll be playing that Black Opal. Um, so one of those two ships will be will be the next one, uh, no matter what. A Mantis ship hails you through the storm. Okay. Good thing you guys are ready to teleport on board. <clears throat> okay, let's uh, let's actually go right into the med bay and lock it down. Because if we can destroy his med bay, and I don't even need to dodge really, because he only can shoot two things. So we'll just wait for his guys to come down. We, these guys can soften them up a little bit. Then I'll teleport into weapons. Then we'll all just go into weapons and kill them. Uh, yeah, let's do two on... Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> we'll do three on two. I thought two on one with the Mantis would be nicer than... Uh, then three on two with the Mantis and the NG. Okay. There we go. Still no people, which is getting annoying. I would like some people. I need a pilot so I can get my three guys going down all at once. Or uh, either a pilot for that or a... Um, a Mantis to go all in, along the, uh, the boarding party here. Okay, moving along. Uh... Did I buy my piloting? I did, so yeah, we definitely want to hit every nebula we can. Continue! Okay, they can hurt us. Let's let them teleport on board. And then teleport in there, and Nigel, lock it down. And where are they? They're indoors. They're right frickin' there. Okay, and there sounds like there's two of them. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna let them beat me up a little bit. Oh, don't break my doors. Oh, and then they came in here. Crap. Uh, med bay. And I might die. <laughs> uh, and I... They still got the... Oh, boy. This is bad. I'm gonna do that, and then we're gonna do that. They can actually kill me in here. Um... Okay, I'm going to teleport into there and help my friends. And then we're just going to void the entire ship of air. Don't kill my oxygen! Don't kill my oxygen! Oh, they gave up on my oxygen. Okay. Now I'm going to close this and open this. <laughs> Come on, kill him. There we go. Good job. Whew! <laughs> okay, now nobody's coming back until we've got some oxygen on our ship. That was crazy. I thought for sure I was dead. 14 health. Running, beat up, running with no oxygen through the through the ship. Good thing he was a crystal dude, because they uh, have a little bit of extra oxygen, uh, what do you call it? Resistance. Lack of oxygen resistance, I guess would be the right term. That was a scary fight. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna lie. We are gonna now use this money that we have to upgrade our engines one more, and by the power for it. And now we're where we want to be by the end of the sector, which is awesome. And we can start thinking about. I would really like a weapon, to be honest, for situations exactly like this one where I can't. Yeah, but if you'll see, there we go, I'm back to the nice lines. So he can't hurt us, which is nice. We just got to take our lumps here, get a little bit of experience, and be on our merry way. But yeah, I'm excited about Advanced Edition. From what I've heard... From what I've heard and seen on the internet, uh, looks like it's going to be really fun. Looks like a lot of opportunities to uh, a lot of opportunities for for different. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll sell you guys for different strategical 
plans and stuff, like the uh, you know, like mind control and hacking their systems and things like that. Uh, I'm looking forward to it. I'm also looking forward to ever finding a ship I could actually fight. This one has bombs, which is annoying. I'll cloak to the first one. But uh, after that, I got to just take whatever he throws at me. And it's an ion bomb. So he can take out my shield with it. Which is awesome. The nice thing about ion bombs is they take forever to charge. So I think with that single cloak, I'll be able to get out of here before he shoots another one at me. And I was right. Okay. Let's try here. Maybe this won't be an automated scout. Well, it's the functional equivalent of an automated scout that couldn't hurt me. <laughs> ah! Oh my lord. This guy can hurt me. He's got three shots, so I gotta watch. As soon as my shields go down, I gotta cloak. Actually, as soon as my shields go down with a shot on the way, I'm going to cloak. So far, so good. I'm probably good to go. I would like to not cloak so that I show up in the next battle with an actual cloak. Okay. It's a store here, but I have no money or anything, and I can't even check my stores. So, I am going to not go to it. Even though I would love to buy a weapon there. Like, seriously, I could win this battle. By teleporting my guys over, like, three times, taking his shields down. <laughs> but in the meantime, his, his ship would absolutely destroy me. This is not the kind of ship you expect to see in the second sector. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't care <laughs> that I'm playing in hard mode. This is freaking ridiculous. I'm just going to leave my weapons down. Who cares about them? Uh, okay, one, two, three, probably. One, two. I want to go to this distress call, and I can't get there if I go here. One, two, three. It kind of looks like we have four. One, two, three. I think we do. It's hard to judge sometimes when they're, when they're the weird. Somebody's on board. Let's accept his proposal. And, oh my god, he actually is a real person who wants to help me. Okay. So it's, sadly it's going to take a while for me to get down there. Okay, let's get in. Yeah, shields, because we don't care. So let's kill their people one at a time. <laughs> okay, I'm going to actually trade you two. <laughs> okay, and a hole missile! Now there's a reason to fix the weapons, of course, right after they got damaged, so might as well do that. Uh, actually, let's leave the oxygen on, shall we? Fifth, you get up there and help. By the time you guys would get up there, it'll be fixed, so don't bother. You get all the way over there, you get up there. Okay. Um, and the weapons are going to take 60. To actually charge up, but and missiles suck. And I, so look at that. Somebody I can't fight. Um, I can though take out his weapons. To hopefully get that missile down before it hurts me. There we go. Just good practice. Even though we can't win this fight, 
we can at least not take any damage. Everybody healed. Uh, get the oxygen bag on and be on our merry way. Ooh. I honestly can't tell. The thing is, is, is the reason it's a decision. I don't mind fighting the rebels. Um, my, my problem is that there's a very good chance that they'll be here when I go here. So I want to go here, here, and back. But I don't want to do that. I don't want to have to fight the rebels. I'm going to go to the distress call and hope that they don't overrun that thing. I'm down to two fuel on a boarding ship. And they want four. You guys suck. At least the rebels aren't at the exit. At least I don't think they are. Hire the mercenary to delay... Yeah, we're not going to do that. We're going to fight you. And hopefully... Let's see. That fires one, so we don't care about that. But that's the only size four room in the entire place. And I locked it down before. <laughs> I'm so good at this game. You know what? Human, get down there. And what we want to do is as soon as somebody... Runs for the med bay. We are going to lock the room down again. Send our human down. <laughs> ah, that's a good time. 26 scrap and a fuel. Better than nothing, I guess. Okay, human, you did not take any damage, so... And we can just jump to the next sector while they're healing because it doesn't matter. Oh, Mantis controlled. Yeah, it's better than Zoltan Homeworld, that's for sure. Might have to upgrade my doors. <coughs> the problem with Mantis controlled is we have one fuel. Uh, okay, let's hope this takes us somewhere that will give us fuel. Aid the civilian ship. Well, yes. We're going to let them on board, and then we're going to teleport on. We're going to open up all doors except for these two. Actually, we'll selectively close some doors. And then our human might end up having to run away, but there's not much he can do about that. Actually, no, that doesn't work. Um... Okay, they can't hurt us anymore down there. Okay, they are running all the way here, so let's open this door preemptively. <laughs> and then what he is going to do is he is going to go back into the teleporter as soon as it's free. Which is right about now. And teleport back in there. There we go. Now we better lock this room down before... Okay, let's get this room with, out of air. And they're gonna die. <laughs> there we go. Contact the civilian ship. No fuel, and they're dead. We have no fuel. Annoying. Okay, let's get some air on the ship. Let's head on home. Heal ourselves up. Including the pilot. We're feeling generous here. Okay. Um, well, let's turn on the distress call and see what happens here. Gladly trade. Two fuel for four missiles. Deal. And there's a store there, and we're probably going to hit the Rebels if we go to it. But we have far more scrap than we do fuel, so we're going. That felt better. Okay. Um, ugh. Yeah, we have to backtrack. Uh, okay, now, what... We have 69. We can upgrade to get that whole missile online, but we have no missiles. I think we're better off oops, selling the whole missile just to get the scrap. Buying 
I don't want drone control right now. We don't have enough drones. Um, I'm not going to buy anything. I am going to... Uh, what are we in Sector 3? I am going to get one more dodge. And then we'll buy the we'll buy the third shield at the end of sector four. I'm starting to change that strategy. I used to say my third shield in sector three, but now I'm starting to think my fifth dodge in sector three and my third shield in sector four. Gives you a little bit of extra scrap in sector three to buy something. Assuming anybody is ever selling anything. Uh demand the surrender of the goods. Yes, because you're guaranteed to be a, a ship full of people. Okay, let's teleport right into your weapons. And you're in my weapons, so let's make you not want to be in my weapons anymore. Okay, and then let's make you not want to be in my scanners anymore. Or in my med bay. Let's see, now you can let you guys in there, and you don't have a med bay, so... I'm actually going to open this door to hopefully keep him from running to my pilot room. Okay, good. Um, and yeah, I don't see any reason to do anything other than what I'm just doing. 